Kelsey for short. You may recognize me from such roles as college degree carrying minimum wage worker or actress without a stage. Well, I'm here today to talk to you about the life or death decision that you're going to have to make in all about six and a half minutes. Now, let's hope you choose wisely. Before we get into all that, though, I'm sure you're wondering, what is it that I clicked on? What is this 30 till 30 thing? Um, either that or your cat is watching this, um, which is also cool. I mean, hey, kitty. No, you stop. <laughs> well, 30 till 30 was born as a dear friend of mine was standing on the edge of a cliff and was literally going to die. Um, but not in a real life Stallone cliffhanger kind of way, more so um, like a valley girl who literally can't um, manifest it in a grown ass man kind of die. Um, it was his 30th birthday and when he came to me, it was completely apparent that no amount of free booze or food or even Target gift cards were gonna lift his little baby spirits. Um, he confided in me that he felt like at this point he hadn't accomplished enough. He hadn't seen enough and pretty much like he really hadn't lived. Um, now I was kind of puzzled by this because from the outside looking in, he had it sweet. I mean, it seemed like he really had it together. He has a great job, um, awesome friends, um, family, and he seemed to like really truly be on the path to traditional gay American success. Um, e.g. beautiful home, uh, beautiful husband, a few adopted little hybrid babies running around that joint. Um, I comforted him the best that I could, um, but as he left and then proceeded to go get Stone Cold Wasted, um, it sunk in at that moment that I was right there with him. I mean, I had set goals at 25 that to this day still are stored in the cloud in a file labeled um, to do. Um, back then, I saw the world so differently. I mean, because at the time, it seemed like I had so much time. Um, too much even, to the point where I would literally wish time away. Um, I figured that by 30, I'd be married, well established in my career path, and I mean, I'd be happy, I'd have it all together. Man, I was tripping. I had wasted so many moments basing decisions on what I thought to be practicality, but what actually turned out to be a combination of both fear and perfection paralysis. Um, I allowed the perceived perception of people that I don't even associate with anymore um, and the relationship that I was in at the time to dictate my actions or better yet dictate my inaction. Um, I was a sadomasochist, seriously. I, I constantly beat myself up over not following my dreams, but then I would skirt around the steps towards making them happen and make tons of excuses. Um, honestly, it took uh, getting pregnant, the relationship and the stock market crashing, um, a cross country move, um, having to live in my Grammy's spare room, severe depression, and basically hitting the reset button on adulthood, but this time with a small child in tow. Um, it took all of that for me to realize that I could change the path I was on. Um, it was only as hard as I had built it up to be. I mean, <sighs> If you don't count the nine month gestational period, which I don't, I will officially turn 30 on December 3rd. Uh, that means that exactly 30 days from today, I'll be 30 years old. Is it making sense now? Okay, stay with me. <laughs> 30 till 30 is my way of celebrating the last 30 days of my 29th year. And I plan to usher in the next 30 years by living in the now and um, dying to the past with every moment. Over the course of four videos, um, one posted to YouTube uh, for every week of the month, I'll be using YouTube, Google, my sense of humor, um, and good old fashioned determination, also known as sleep deprivation, to accomplish the goals that I set at 25, plus a few major additions that I've tacked onto the list over the years. Um, I'll do my best to document the whole thing, and I really want you guys to come on this ridiculous, crazy ride. I mean, because who rides a roller coaster alone? Um, 
Now about that life or death decision that you have to make, here it is. I mean, purely sitting back and watching me trek through the next 30 days is predicted to be highly entertaining. <laughs> Shit, for all it took to get here in this moment, I should at least elicit a few chuckles. I mean, however, watching my life play it on YouTube is a little voyeuristic, creepy even. And I know that you're not a creep, right? So instead of pretending to live vicariously through me, I challenge you to take the 30 till 30 challenge and actually live a life of your own making. Now, regardless if you're watching this today or two years from now in some weird YouTube time warp, pull out that crumpled, tired list of New Year's resolutions or two that you might have. And I mean, you don't have to be 29 to join me. You can be 20 going on 21 or 99 going on 100. Um, but if you have dreams unlived and goals on the back burner, man, bust them bad boys out and do this thing with me. I mean... Alone, I'm just a beautiful, crazy woman with a camera and some dreams and a deadline. But together, we are journeymen. It took the Israelites 40 years to cover ground that should have only taken 11 days. They had to wander the wilderness together until they had grown enough in faith, until they could finally appreciate the promised land for what it really was. Most most of them died before they even caught a glimpse of it. I challenge you to choose life over a death in stagnation. Manifest your faith in your goals and carry them out. Reach the promised land of inner acceptance and defy death by shedding fear and excuses. Document your journey and share it with the rest of us. Hashtag 30 till 30. And I mean, seriously, feel free to comment below. I mean, I promise to be like that Michael Jackson meme where he's like eating popcorn in a movie theater from Thriller and like, um, the, he had, like you know, his Jerry Curl is like super on point. I mean, like I'm on all the social medias, baby, so follow me. And let's just jump these hurdles together. Like if we stumble and, and fall along the way, we're better for it. Just as long as we get back up after we fall. So are, are you in? Are you ready to live? Let's do it. I'll see y'all next week.